Dear students, now let us move for another one example of radius of curvature. So find the radius of curvature for the curve y square is equal to 4a square into bracket 2a minus x divided by x. Where the curve meets the x-axis. They have given the statement where the curve meets the x-axis and they have not given the point here. So as we know that, as we know that if the curve meets the x-axis then y becomes 0. So if it is curve passing to the x-axis, so see here if I take an xy plane here, if I take xy plane, if i passes the curve from here, if it cuts here, intersects here, so therefore here y becomes 0. So therefore only x points remains here, so then y becomes 0. Now substitute this y value in the given curve, so this becomes 0, okay. Transfer this x, it again becomes 0. Only 4a square uh, into 2a minus x is equal to 0. Now transfer 4a to that side. Again it becomes a 0. So 2a, uh, uh, 2a minus x, 2a minus x is equal to 0. Therefore x is equal to 2a. Transfer this x to this side. So it becomes x is equal to 2a. You got x is equal to 2a and y is equal to 0. So thus the 2a comma 0 is the point of curve at which we have to find the radius of curvature. This is a point and we have to find the radius of curvature at this point only. So given equation can be put in the form of, okay, to find the radius of curvature, you multiply this inside. So let me write down y square as it is, multiply 4a square into 2a, 8a cube, 8a cube. Then 4 into this, so 4a square x divided by x is there, okay. I have divided this common LCM for both the terms. So I have divided for this, I have divided for this here. This you keep as it is here x is cancel minus 4a square remains. So now you differentiate with respect to x here because you have to find the radius of curvature. You need to find here, I can write here we have, we have radius of curvature is equal to 1 plus y1 square raised to 3 by 2 divided by y2. You need to find y1, you need to find y2. So to find this one you have to differentiate. So differentiation of y square is 2y, differentiation of y is y1 is equal to 8a cube. Okay. Uh, differentiation of 1 by x is minus 1 divided by x square. This is a constant. As you know that 1 by x square differentiation is minus 1 by x square. Remember, so minus 4 a square is constant 0. I have not written it. So therefore, if you want y1, so keep y1, transfer this to this side. So it become 8 a cube minus, so minus 8 a cube divided by x square into 2y. x square into 2y. So therefore, you can cancel here 2 1s are 2 4s are 2 1s are 2 4s are so minus 4a cube minus 4a cube divided by y x square. So you got y1. Now let us find the y2 there. Okay. So to find this, uh, sorry, you have find y1. So you have to find y1 at the given points. So at the given points. So for that one, so let us go like this. Ha. So y1 at the point 2a comma 0. Now substitute x value as 2a x value is 2a and y value is 0. So if I substitute this here 0, so anything by 0 it becomes infinity. So as we got again infinity here, so y1 got infinity. So y1 is infinite, therefore use the alternate formula. So what is alternate formula? For alternate formula is this one, which I have taught in the previous example. Okay. So you need to find x1 and x2. So x1 is easiest way to find. Because if you see x1 here, uh, so y1, if you see y1, so this is y1. If you make a reciprocal, you will get x1. So y x square divided by minus 4a cube, that is the x1 value. Okay. So if you substitute the values again, this one, you will get again a 0 here. Because you make a reciprocal for this one. 0 by minus 4a cube becomes, so therefore it becomes a 0 here. So x1 you got as a 0. Okay. Then further, let us calculate the x2. So x2 is, so you have to differentiate this with respect to y. So see here, denominator minus 1 divided by 4a cube is a constant. Again, product rule for here, taking minus outside, first function as it is. Differentiation of y is y1. Because you are doing with respect to y. Plus y as it is, differentiation of x square is 2x, then differentiation of x is x dash. Because you are doing with respect to y. Remember. Okay, now in this, uh, in this expression, you need to substitute a 2a comma 0 x and y substitute here x values so this term as it is x values uh, if you substitute this one 4a square and here x1 already we got 0 so it becomes a 0 so you got this one now you can cancel 4 4 here 2 or 2 1 get cancel so minus 1 by a so minus 1 by a you got the answer so therefore radius of curvature is given as that is <coughs> 1 plus x1 0 x1 this formula x1 is 0 then raised to 3 by 2 divided by x2 is minus 1 by 
Okay, denominator of denominator is minus. So as I told you, radius of curvature should not be in a negative form. So therefore, we have to get the absolute value. To get the absolute value, so you have to apply the mod on the both sides. So therefore, mod of uh, radius of curvature rho is given as plus a. So this is a required radius of curvature. Okay. I will uh, uh, go to example as a homework for you. The examples are given as like this. That is. Uh, Find the radius of curvature for the folium of D cards x cube plus y cube is equal to 3axy. Add the point 3a divided by 2 comma 3a divided by 2 on it. So this type of curve, uh, I think I already solved this one. Uh, you see that the previous examples, so 1, 2, 3, 4 examples, you get to know this one. First find x1, uh, sorry y1 then find y2 substitute in radius of curvature formula add this point this is x1 and uh, y1 okay x and y then another one example is there find the radius of curvature for the curve x y cube is equal to a raised to 4 at the point x and y so you have to find this one also the radius of curvature so i want this solution uh, uh, i want this solution uh, you send in a um, either image photo or you can send by a pdf i will check it and i will tell you is it a correct or wrong is there okay so you follow the previous four examples uh, you get to know so let me solve some more examples in next class okay so uh, as you got and i will give one information regarding uh, uh, regarding that uh, um, uh, regarding that uh, offline classes so as madam has put the message for you uh, that uh, on our online class will commence from 18 onwards okay so be ready for the offline uh, sorry offline classes so as uh, per the instructions given by the madam uh, you have to follow the instructions uh, and you have to follow the covid rules and regulations uh, so then you can uh, join your offline classes okay uh, thank you uh, we will continue some more examples uh, which I used to take the examples uh, of radius of curvature only uh, which is in a uh, parametric form which is in a parametric form okay so when it is given a parametric form how to find the radius of curvature I will tell you so in the coming next video lecture thank you